is going on, everybody? Hump day, Wednesday. Hopefully everybody's staying safe. What's up, Jack, Brady, Scott, Scott and Scott, Darren, Joey, Angelo, VJ. What's going on? Get a couple tags here and then we'll uh, get this show on the road. What's up, Jeffrey? And who else do I need to tag? James Bryant. What's up, Corey? Got James Bryant. You guys know how it goes. The first couple minutes here, there's always a little tagging going on. Michael Steffen, what's up, dude? I just have uh, two little setting adjustments I have to make really fast. Hopefully you guys across the country are safe and spending some quality time with your families while you can. up here in Montana, my, uh, my fiance, fiance and I are both considered essential workers. So we're blessed, blessed to still be going to work every day. We're thankful for that. I'd say we're about three minutes away from uh, getting this first one started here. I don't want to take too long to get the pre-fills done because I know people might want to go somewhere else. I know there's a couple other people that are live right now. But we have uh, break number 12 is filled. Break number 13 has four spots left that we will live fill. And then, um, yeah. So, without further ado, This is break number 12. Um, I'm waiting for one more person to see if they're, this is their first time playing, so I wanna see if they get in here or not.
give them a quick little minute here and then we'll start. For anyone who's playing that doesn't know, um, this break, the rest of the breaks of this series, I think, are just going to be a simple um, 10 spot, top spot on random, picks what box they want. The next series, I'm going to do one more mini helmet series because I've already started putting it together. And then I'm going to shut down until this whole crisis thing is over. Um, so after this is done, I'll run one more and then probably wait, wait for everything to go back to normal. And, uh, nice Lannon's here really quick. Also, if we have downtime and anyone wants Jersey roulette, it's now a thing. Um, right now, Emmett Smith Jersey is the only option I will put together more options. Basically how it works is same way we do this. You have your 10 spots. Obviously, the price goes up a little more the more spots you buy because your chances are a lot higher and you can win that, you know, jersey that's worth way more than $100. You have almost a 40% chance of winning it for $100. And then every, so say someone spent $100, $10 would go into the bounty, the bank, which I already started off putting $20 into it. So it already, the bank already starts off at $20. So you could already win with one spot. You have a 10% chance of winning the Jersey and taking home $20 as well. So just know that's an option if anyone feels like it, but everyone's here. We're going to do this Jersey break number or mini helmet series. Number two, break number 12. You guys know the deal. Fives. We'll roll the dice. Anything five or more, we keep. Anything four or less is a re-roll. Good luck. We got Tony, Lannon, Jack, Scott, Jack, Scott, James, Jack, Lannon, and or Lannon and Jack. Had that second T there. All right. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Five. Top spot, final round, picks a box. If they're not here, we'll randomize it. And our winner is James. James Bryant. I don't even know if James is in here. Congratulations, James. Nice. Congratulations, James. Here, let me move out of the way so you can see the box numbers. Update this really quick. James, here's the box numbers. You go ahead and pick your box. We'll break it open. See what's inside. Nice. First one ever. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Tony, you just joined. Uh, James just won that break number 12 that you were in. Uh, he was a he was a one spot one spot win also. Only one spot. 24 for Kobe. You got it, box. Number 24. Box 24, James. Good luck. James, what's your favorite team? I like to get to know you guys a little bit. I want to know what everyone's favorite team is. Just so I know. Tate, bottom, top. The 
Eagles, oh, you are not going to be a happy man. Here's your JSA card. Here we have Mr. Hall of Famer, Chrome Michael Strahan. Chrome Michael Strahan Mini Hall of Fame script 2014. Congratulations, James, on your Michael Strahan. Chrome Mini. James, if you want to shoot me a PM with your address and everything, I can ship that out for you in the morning or I can hold it. And at the end of the series, you can keep an eye out. And if there's something you want to trade for, you can definitely trade for that. But Michael Strahan, Hall of Famer, Chrome. Jack, yep, Jack Lee did just win the uh, Donovan McNabb a couple days ago. Nice Chrome Donovan McNabb. Joe, when I'm, I'll put the next one up in a second, and I'll type open. And once I type open, people can go ahead and start calling spots. James, congrats on your Michael Strahan, Hall of Famer. All right, Mini Helmet Series number two, break number 13. We have four spots left, and we are open. Zach Campbell, what's going on? We got spots. One, four, nine, and ten are open here. One, four, nine, and ten. Twenty-three dollars a spot. Still have a lot of crown jewels left. And a lot of really nice fillers. Um I know that there's four fillers in there I've seen that are crown or headliners in other people's series, whether it's jersey series, helmet series. Joe's going to start off and take spot four. Um. Landon's going to take spot 10. Yeah, Scott, that mini is still open because those will just all carry into the next break, next available break. But if you want to go ahead and close it out, um, if you want to close out that mini, just let me know and we can put the $12 you already paid towards a spot here if you want. Um... Mark Arvinson from YouTube. Might be taking the nine spot. We'll see. So, Scott, just let me know. Same with you, Jack. Uh, Jack, you have... Right now, Jack, I have $33 from you that you could put. If you want to put buy a spot in here, you've already paid for it. Scott, if you want to buy a spot in here, you only owe $11 for it. And then I'll just close out those minis. Okay. Scott Hale's got nine.
Yep, Scott, that's fine. That's fine. So we got spot number one left. Mark Arvinson's gonna take spot number one from YouTube. Mark Arvinson's gonna take spot one. He is our YouTube watcher. So, let's get ready to bust open another box. Let me get rid of that box number 24. Pretty sure Brad White's probably watching Chasing the Boom, but I'm just going to let him know that he is up in this break. And I think everyone else that's in here is here. Greg, welcome. Yes, 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 yes. All right. We are ready to rock and roll. Many Helmet Series number two, break number 13. We got Mark, Brad, Brady, Joe, Scott, Scott, Brad, Jack, Scott, and Lannon. Good luck, everybody. Roll the dice. Five or more we keep. Four or less is a re-roll. Top spot, final round, picks a box. Six. We got six. And Brad White. Man, this guy. This guy comes in here and wins a lot. He buys a lot of spots in here. He wins a lot. He shows a lot of love in a lot of different break rooms. And he also runs a break room, uh, Goodfellas Memorabilia. Good group of guys. Yeah, Corey, um, I don't think you're in any of these. But if you ever are, I will always take you. Okay, we're going to see if... Uh... Wait for Brad. If you guys want, we can start doing a filled break number 14. We've got some people in here. We can see if it gets filled or not. And I'll give Brad a couple minutes to get in here. Brady, you want to give the jersey a shot? You can let me know. If you want to give the jersey a shot, like I said, here's the rules. You pick a spot just like normal. Those are the costs. If you want four spots, it's $100. Three spots, it's 60 And then you pick the number of rounds. We'll run it. 
whatever number you pick is how many rounds I'll enter, and that's how many we'll do. Top spot wins, either you or the house. And then, uh... Then you'll also take home the bank, which there is $20 in the bank. Uh, yeah, Corey, that was something different. I don't have any $8, I don't have any $8 breaks. That might have been a different break room or a different mini helmet series. Um, because I have a... $23 break, $28 break, and a $14.50 break. $10 number three, three rounds. All right. Good luck, Brady. I'm setting it up now. I'll go over to the screen as soon as I get it set up. It'll just take a quick second here. What's up, Jeremy Prophet? Brady is about to try our first uh, Jersey Roulette. He's going to go to spot three. Brad White, welcome. We're about to run a jersey roulette, Brad. And then if you want to pick your box for the... Yes, Brad, it is your pick. It is your pick. Just give us one second. Brad, you can pick your box now. Brady's going to try this... Uh, Jersey Roulette. All right. Here we go. Brady, you wanted three rounds. You wanted spot three. Get rid of this. Boom. Roulette wheel. It ain't going to spin or nothing. It's just there. Okay, Brad, um, let me run this really quick. Okay, bank, Brady, bank's 20 bucks. We're going to run this. If you finish top spot after the third round, you win the jersey and the $20 bank. Uh, and I'm going to put 10% of your buy-in into the bank after this. So it'll go up to 21. Good luck, Brady. Here we go. Oh, man. Oh, man. Wow. Wow. It's a real kick in the knockers, bro. Damn. Damn. I just took a hit right there. About $250 hit. Brady. Congratulations on your Emmett Smith jersey. Congratulations. That that is crazy, dude. Congratulations, man. That's fucking awesome. That's what this is all about. You just won a hell of a jersey and 20 bucks. So I just paid you for that jersey. <laughs> Don't worry about it, Brady. Don't worry about it. All right. Congratulations, Brady. That was awesome. Hell of a pick. That's our last winner. No, don't, you guys, don't apologize. I'm, I'm happy for him because that's what this is all about. I want people to get cool shit for cheap prices. Huge. That was huge, Brady. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. All right, Brad White, you're up. Brad White, there's your box options. Go ahead and pick your box.
We got 1, 3, 4, 6, 9, 11, 14, 16, 17, 19, 20, 21. Damn, Brady, you crazy. You know, there's pros and cons to that. The pros are people are going to see that it's not rigged. And then the cons are that was a hit I just took. Blake says 14 for his birthday. Yeah. If anyone just showed up, uh, Brady just took a chance at the Jersey Roulette. He bought one out of the 10 spots, and he took home the Emmett Smith jersey for $10, but I'm paying him 20 for the bank. And, uh, yeah, so he just took home... A three hundred dollar jersey for ten bucks. Number fourteen, we have a crown jewel for Blake's birthday. We have there it is. Happy birthday, Blake. There is your Beckett. This has got a Beckett and a Fanatics dual authenticated Ben Roethlisberger Chrome. Look how shiny that is. Ben Roethlisberger Chrome Mini. One of our headliners, Crown Jewel. Uh, for some reason, the chrome is showing up red. Let me fix that. Congratulations, Blake and Brad White. Congratulations. Brad, you come in here and you hit those crown jewels. And you hit those helmets. You got that. You got that. So, congratulations, Brad. Congratulations, Break. <laughs> Break. Blake. Is that your third crown jewel this series you hit? Brad, we pulled one earlier. Uh, James Bryant won. I guess you can't see me. I'm going to show you really fast. James Bryant won this Michael Strahan chrome. Hall of Fame script. That was the first break of the night. Three jewels. That's awesome. All right. Uh, Derek, the break prices are $23. $23 a break. Um, some people, I had someone the other day talk about how high those prices were, and they seen a Brady for, go for 20, but I'm telling you right now that no helmets in here are, there's, uh, oh yeah, JJ Watt, Barry Sanders, Big Ben. There's still four more helmets in here I've seen advertised as headliners on other pages all right if you guys want to get in we got break series number two break number 14 is open $23 a spot uh, Derek you still have like 31 Jack Lee's gonna take spots three and eight Derek you still have like $31 I think and break credit with me Jack's three and eight. 
Jeez. Sorry, guys. I'm just waking up. Some of you don't know. I work graveyard shift, so it's my early morning. I go to work in about an hour and a half. So my brain's still a little foggy. Damn. Can we just stop for a second? The fact that Brady came in on that first Jersey Roulette and hit right off the bat is just crazy. How many R's do you need, Derek? <laughs> All right. We still have spots 1, 4, 6, 9, and 10 are still available. Nice. Couple people just joined. Brady Wassum. <laughs> There you go, dude. You get all the R's you want. Three in the first, one in the fourth. Brady Wassum just hit this autographed Emmett Smith dual certified jersey out of Jersey Roulette. He bought one spot for 10 bucks. And he took home this jersey. And I paid him $10. Because there was $20. I put $20 to start off the bank. So he hit this jersey. And so he, I just paid him $10 to take this Emmett Smith jersey off my hand. Yep, Colton, he was the first one to try it. He said, give me spot three. Nick Lopez is going to take spot six. He said, he said, give me spot three, three rounds. Gave him spot three, ran it three rounds. And the guy took it home, dude. It'll match that Troy Aikman he just won a couple weeks ago. Um, that was the only one. I mean, I have. I have a couple jerseys here, but. I have an Irvin's jersey. I have a Dante Pettis jersey. And I have a Keep to lead. A Keep to lead jersey. But these jerseys are nowhere near the value of that other one, so. Those jerseys there I'll probably just be sending out once in a while after people play. If they play for a while and don't win, I'll send them out as like a consolation prize. Thanks for participating. Things like that. All right, we still got spots one, four, nine, and ten. Scott's going to take four and nine also. Scott's chasing that Peyton Manning chrome that we have. I actually might have someone trying to buy. Oops, my bad. <laughs> yeah, fuck, I knew it. My bad, Mark. Mark's gonna close it. Mark's gonna close it with 10 and one. Off of YouTube. All right. Um, I didn't update that headliner or the crown jewel. Just know that uh, Ben Roethlisberger Chrome is gone. The Ben Roethlisberger Chrome is gone. <laughs> Uh, 
All right. Is this 14? Yep. Here we go. Good luck, everybody. Please send your payments in. I do do a recap all the time, and I'll send you an invoice if I don't receive your payment. We got Mark, Derek, Jack, Scott, Scott, Nick, Scott, Jack, Scott, Mark. Roll the dice. Five rounds or more we keep. Four or less is a re-roll. Good luck. Six. Top spot, final round, picks a box. Top spot, final round, picks a box. Scott. Congratulations, Scott. Congratulations, Scott. Let's hope that you can hit that Peyton Manning you are searching for. I want you guys to hit the helmets you want. Yep, Scott, you finally earned that one. You, uh, that six spotter you bought the other day, that was rough. That was rough. Scott, there's your boxes. One, three, four, six, nine, eleven, sixteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, eighteen. 11, 16, 17, 19, 20, 21, 18. Oh, those are backwards. Box number 18, perfect. I don't even have to fix it. Box number 18, Scott. 18, payment. If that is the case, that'd be crazy because this is just as much as a surprise for me as it is for you because I put everything in the boxes, tape them up, and then the fiance comes down, shuffles up. Oh shuffles them up and numbers them so I don't even know what's in what box box number 18 it's not Peyton Manning but it is a crown jewel not Peyton but it is a crown jewel There's your JSA card. JSA sticker. And we have Mr. Andre Johnson. Cortland Finnegan's daddy. Mr. Andre Johnson. Nice hit. Nice hit. Scott, I know it's not the hit you were looking for, but it's still a nice hit from Mr. Andre Johnson. Or, aka, Cortland Finnegan's daddy. <laughs> yeah. Yep, Scott, if you want, if you want, I can hold this. Uh, if you guys don't want me to ship it out until the series is over, I will hold any mini helmets you guys win or any jerseys or anything until the series is over in case you guys want to try to work out a trade with somebody. 
I have no problem holding on to them. Your names are all written in the box. I close the box back up, set them aside, um, and then I'll ship them out when you guys want to. Congratulations, Scott, on your Andre Johnson. Um, if you guys want, we can do uh, an AFC NFC. These are fourteen fifty a spot. You pick your spot. Once they're full, we'll run a random, and you'll get a random AFC team and a random NFC team. It's a little cheaper, but it takes more people to fill. I don't know if we have enough people. Or we can do a whole division. The divisions are a little bit more because your chances are higher. Yeah, that giant's not allowed in my house. James, I hear you on that. I, this whole series I put together, James, I'm a Cowboys fan. I didn't even buy one. I didn't even buy one Cowboys helmet in this series. Because I refuse. I've already done a Zeke, a couple Zeke's. I refuse to spend money on anything that has Dak Prescott's name on it. Can't stand the guy. So. All right, we can do a regular one. We'll, uh, I like the regular ones personally. I know a lot of people don't like them. Um, a lot of people feel like they're rigged in a way. Um, I have no way of rigging them. I mean, you guys are watching me run the randoms. Uh, The reason why I like them is because every spot gives you a chance. Every spot gives you a chance to win. Sometimes, you know, if you get a division or a team, that team's not in there or that division's not in there. So you're not guaranteed. We are open for break number 15. Open for break number 15. Ben Roethlisberger's gone. And... Mr. Andre Johnson's gone. So Jack Lee's got three and eight. Um, Nick Lopez, you got spot six. Miss on three. Chris, miss on three. Kathleen's got spot five. Thank you, Kathleen. Yeah, the only one that was cooler, Colton, is, um, Chris, you chose three, but if you look up here in the comments... Jack Lee's got three and eight, and then you don't have three until down here. So he actually called it first. Chris Gross is going to take spot seven. Nick Lopez is going to take spot two. Let me check my phone for you to... Um... Mark, if you're there, I got my phone up from YouTube just in case this time. Um, Colton Knight, Brad White won. He's won two Barry Sanders helmets from me. He won that Matt Black one we had in this series. And then I had another Barry Sanders one just like that one, except it was chrome. But it was the exact same thing, and the thing was nasty. I seen a full-size one just like it, and it was crazy.
All right, we got spots one, four, nine, and ten. You guys want tag your friends, get them in here. The more, the merrier. The faster things fill. While we're waiting, I'll update this list. We got spots one, four, nine, and ten. One, four, nine, ten. It's twenty three dollars a spot. We've already pulled some nice hits tonight. Headliners, crown jewels are dropping like flies. Sixty six percent of the hits are crown jewels. Um, also, I'm going to introduce that this weekend. Um, I haven't done it yet, but we're going to introduce the hitbox. What the hitbox is going to be is for people that collect cards, you'll buy a spot. You have to pay, we'll ship weekly, so you have to pay $5 for your shipping. But basically, what it is is you'll pay for a poll. Um, we're not sure if it's going to be, it might be $10 a pull. The more you buy, the better of a discount you'll get. But there's cards in here from relics, autographs, uh, and then, oh, Tony Romo, five of five. That's my guy. Favorite cowboy of all time, Mr. Tony Romo, Romo. But anyway, so we'll do this, and then the way it works is if you pull a parallel, you'll get a second pick. Um, we'll have chasers, chaser cards, so if you, they'll have a number on them, and then if you pull that card with the number, you'll get the big card that's sitting outside the box that has a number. Um, I pulled a Kyler Murray prism. I got a... Joe Burrow auto. Uh, I hit a Joe Burrow auto the other night out of a leaf box. It was sick. Yeah, Colton, whenever you're ready, man. Uh, whenever you're ready to play, we're ready to have you. We've got spots 1, 4, 9, and 10. 1, 4, 9, and 10. I've got something pretty crazy coming in the mail tomorrow. I don't know if I'll announce it quite yet. For the next... Oh! Oh, I thought... <laughs> Colton, I thought you were calling number nine for a second. I was like, damn, here he goes. Uh, Brock, we're going to start the card thing probably Friday. Um, I'm thinking Friday we'll drop it. Yeah, I got you, Colton. I knew what you were saying. I knew what you were saying. What's up, Dennis? And
And uh, Brock, I'm, we're not 100% set on how we're going to run it yet. It's going to be something like that. You'll basically, what you'll do is you'll, I'll go over here while we wait just to get a bigger screen. So basically what's going to happen is you're going to call a spot and you're going to say left or right. And then you're going to say number 13. So we'd count. I'd count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. And you would have got this Bradley Beal parallel 22 of 25. But since how it's a parallel, you'd get to pick again. So then you'd say, you know, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. And you would hit this Darius Leonard 23 of 25 auto. Something along the lines of that. And then we'd only ship them out weekly. I mean, and then there's bigger cards, you know, there's couple flawless in here. Um, you know, some graded cards. Brock, if you want to give it a shot now, I mean, hell, why not? Why not? We got nothing. We got nothing going on. We do have, uh, we still have four spots. Four spots open in this. If this doesn't close tonight, I will create a post with it and put these spots in and it'll fill and we'll probably break it tomorrow. And if you decide you don't want your spots, let me know and I'll take them off before I put the post up. All right, Brock. Let's do the damn thing. Brock, you don't have to pay shipping because you're local, so you can just come pick it up. Let me shuffle these up really fast, and then we'll let you pull. We'll let you pull. Oops. I hit this. And uh, Gridiron Fire Breaks, Kyler Murray, Prism, number to 75. About $130, $140 card. All right, Brock, I'll shuffle these up. Um, if it's a autograph parallel... You don't get a redraw. You only get a redraw if it's just a parallel. No auto. No patch. Like, no relic. So, this is the hitbox. The hitbox, we will uh, contribute cards to the hitbox. Uh, weekly. Try to keep it filled with the best we can. We do not have chasers set up yet. There will be chasers. Well, there will be, like, nice cards, you know, $100 cards. Um, yeah, Brock, $10, one pull. Chasers aren't set up yet, but we'll have it, and you'll pull the card out, you know, and it'll have a little sticky on it. It'll say number three, and then we'll grab the chaser that's number three. You'll know what the chasers are. We'll show them. That way you know if you pull it. That way we're not pulling a switcheroo on you or anything. All right, Brock. You can pick to 75. Left or right to 75. Um, if I get past 75, like if there's not 75, then I'll restart at the beginning. So if I get to the end and it's 56. So you'll pick left or right. And you'll say 14 or whatever number you want. So I'll count from the front back to 14 or whatever number you pick. And I'll pull that one out. And if you pick, you can pick to 75. But if I get all the way to the back and say there's only 56, then I start back in front. 57, 58, 59. All right, you want to do two pulls? Let me shuffle these one more time because I showed the front cards. 
All right, Brock, you go ahead and pick your first pull. You want left, 33. Okay, here we go. Left's over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33. So, you hit this Julian Edelman parallel. So that means you get a free pick. That means you get a free pick. So we'll do your right 64. I'm going to try counting a little faster. So you're going to go right 64, and then you'll have one more pick. I don't really have the camera angle set up for this, so just know this is like kind of a trial. All right, right 64. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64. So, you hit a Gerald Henderson parallel. So, that means you get another free pick. So you have, you have two free picks. We'll say you paid for those two. I'm just going to go like this, and I'll just count them down. That'll be easier. But hold on, before you pick again, just know I got to do this really fast because this is the main concern at the moment. We have four spots left in this break number 15. Four spots. $23 a spot. So let us know. Spots 1, 4, 9, and 10. I'm going to put them in the comments. One, four, nine, ten are open. I know. I. Okay. Okay. So. I got you. All right. I'm going to honor this Brock one more time. I'll let you pick one more just because uh, I wasn't sure. But it's only. Uh, two, two parallels. So you can hit, you can pull two parallels and then after that you're done. But I'll let you do one more because I didn't, uh, discuss that. Like I said, we still didn't go all the way through. So Brock, go ahead and pick another number. which side and number you want. Left, number eight. This is left, by the way. L. I'll switch those around later. Oh. 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 Left, number eight. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight. Nikolai Jokic, auto. On card auto, 25 of 25, impeccable. That's a nice card. That is a nice card. Congratulations, Brock. So you paid for one, and you pulled a parallel. 
Another parallel, another parallel. So you have one more, one more pull there. Brock. One more pull. But you can hit, if you hit another parallel on this one, seems how this is a second, this is your paid for pull, you can still do a parallel on this one. All right, right is over here, right number 16. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh, jumping out of the top over there. But this is the one in my hand. All right, you hit a Dwight Howard Atlanta Hawks relic. Or not relic, parallel. 25 of 25. 25 of 25. And since how that's your second one, you go ahead to do one more, Brock. One more pull for hitting that. Dennis, the pulls are 25. No. Or not 25. I'm sorry. $10. I don't know why I said 25. Because I just got done reading that 25 of 25. $10 a pull. You hit a parallel. You get a redraw. Right, top card. Well, Brock, you have to let me shuffle it because you've seen what the top card was. So that doesn't count. Sorry, man. Sorry, I have to shuffle. This top card is sitting right there. I don't know if you've seen it. I don't know if you didn't. Um, I will get a cover card to cover those up. All right, Rob. Shuffled up. You still same top card. Uh, Corey, I don't do... I don't do teams. I did teams once, um, but I don't do teams or divisions. I do pretty much 10 spots. So you pretty much only buy spots in this group. I mean, I do have it set up for teams and stuff, but you can check your PayPal. If you send anything to uh, Gram Slam CM, let me know. Brock, top card on the right, you said. Verify top card on the right. Brock, why I look at this PayPal really fast for Corey. Yeah, Corey, I'm not seeing anything on PayPal from you. Um, check yours. Gram Slam CM or Gage Gram. All right, top card out of the right spot. You've got a Todd Gurley, one of five. Todd Gurley, one of five. From the Panini Honors. So, Brock, for 20 bucks, we'll do a quick recap. Todd Gurley, parallel. Dwight Howard, parallel. Gerald Henderson, parallel. Julian Edelman parallel, and the Nikolai Jokic, impeccable. Auto, on-card auto. Congratulations, Brock, on the hit box. All right, everybody. We've got spots 1, 4, 9, and 10 are still available. One, four, nine, and ten are still available. Twenty-three dollars a spot. If we close this out, we'll make this one our last one of the night. One, four, nine, and ten 
are available. Why are my helmets all messed up? There we go. One, four, nine, ten. Scott's going to take number four. Thank you, Scott. So we got one, nine, and ten. One, nine, and ten are still available. Mark Arvinson is going to take nine off of YouTube. So we got spots one and ten. One and ten. One in ten. Looking for a close on one in ten. This will be our last break of the night. Last break of the night. And then we will... put up a uh, pre-fill for tomorrow or Friday, probably Friday. I'll put up pre-fillers um, and then we will go. Yeah, that sounds good, James. Um, I'll hold it and then whatever. They... Scott, I know that uh, Michael Steffen is a big Andre Johnson fan. I don't know if he's in here still. He was earlier. But he's an Andre Johnson fan that he might be willing to trade. But he's a Broncos fan also, so I don't think that would work. We got spots 1 in 10, 1 in 10, looking for a close. What's up, William? Welcome. <clears throat> 1 in 10. Can't be both. You can be a Broncos fan and an Andre Johnson fan. I know uh, he traded a. Uh, he wanted Juju. He wanted Juju Smith jersey and he traded it for. Um, he wanted Juju jersey and he traded it for a uh, DeAndre Hopkins jersey. Probably a couple days before he went to Arizona. Scott says he'll take 10 if someone's going to close out and take number one. Scott says he'll take 10. James is going to take spot one. Scott's got spot 10. We are closed. Final break of the night. Thank you, everybody. Oops. Sorry, I'll fix that.
Hopefully everyone's safe out there. Hopefully you guys are going to the store. Um, here in Montana, it hasn't really hit yet. Um, I mean, it has, but it's not anything crazy. So, not like the rest of the world. I have friends, you guys, all over the country that I talk to pretty regularly, and it's a pretty bad deal. Okay, so, let's do this thing. Many Helmet Series number two, break number 15. We got James, Nick, Jack, Scott, Kathleen, Nick, Chris, Jack, Mark, Scott. Please send in your payments if you haven't. If not, I'll go through in the morning when I get off work and I'll create invoices and send them out. Here we go. Roll the dice. Anything five or more we keep, four or less is a re-roll. You guys know the drill. Top spot, final round wins. Picks a box. Number eight. Eight rounds. Top spot. Picks a box. Final round winner is Kathleen. Kathleen is our winner. Congratulations, Kathleen. I don't know if she's still in here or not. Oops. I always do that. I'm trying to get things set up while we're waiting to, for boxes. I accidentally clicked the wrong button. Congratulations, Kathleen. I hope I spelt your name right. I think I did. It looks good. Kathleen, go ahead and pick a box. Also, if you guys are new here, we have the thank you box down here. Every spot you buy enters you to win this thank you box. Every spot enters you a chance to win in that thank you box. The hint, it's a dual signed mini helmet. And the hint is these two players are the two, two of the most popular players in franchise history. But they never played more than half a season together. They did not play more than half a season together, but they are both... If you ask about that team, they'll be the first two players to be named. Kathleen, go ahead and pick a box. 1, 3, 4, 6, 9, 11, 16, 17, 19, 20, 21, 26, 27, and 28. After the series is done, I'll enter everyone's names in order of the breaks. And then we run the randomizer 12 times to figure out who wins the thank you box. Box number 21. Box 21. Good luck, Kathleen. Box 21. Sealed on the top. Sealed on the bottom. Let's see what you won. Oh, we have a crown jewel. Mister, definitely argument as the greatest wide receiver in the league. It is a, bli uh, a, a blaze. Mister Julio Jones. Nice, nice, nice hit, Kathleen. There's your JSA cert. Mr. Julio Jones. Headliner is dropping like flies tonight. These crown jewels are not lasting. 
Nice hit, Kathleen. Nice, nice hit. Thank you, Joe. Definitely a good night. Um, like I said earlier, some people say two thirty a box is a little high. I'm gonna tell you right now. Um, eleven of these, there's eleven out of these twenty eight helmets were over the two hundred and thirty dollar buy in. Some of them three hundred dollars plus. So, for a helmet to be considered a crown jewel in my room, it means it's value is over top. Its value is higher than the buy-in cost of a box. So any of these helmets, there's helmets in here that are 220 value, 200 value. But if they're not over the 230, they don't make the cut. So anytime you see a crown jewel in my series, you know that it's worth more. Some people have put things as crown jewels that aren't even worth what the buy-in is. Every break room is a little different. Congrats again, Kathleen. That is a nice, nice hit. All right, everybody. I hope you all had a good hump day. Technically, on my work schedule, it is my Thursday. Um, I go into work here. I leave for work in about a, an hour. I appreciate everyone that showed up. I can do a quick recap really fast. Kathleen won the Julio Jones Crown Jewel. Scott won the Andre Johnson Blaze. James Bryant won. The Michael Strahan with the Hall of Fame script. And Brad White won. The Ben Roethlisberger Chrome. And the big winner of the night, Brady Brady winning this Emmett Smith jersey and 10 bucks. Brady won the Emmett Smith jersey and I paid him 10 bucks to take it off of my hands. Scott, here's a recap. We have your Todd Gurley honors, numbered one of five. We have your Dwight Howard uh, National Treasures, 25 out of 25. Gerald Henderson, 7 of 79. Oh, uh, this is a... I'm not sure what this is. What? It's a... Oh, gold standard. That makes sense. Gold standard. And then we have your Julian Edelman, number 94 of 99, certified. And then we have... Your Nikolai Jokic, 25 of 25, impeccable, on-card auto. On-card auto. I have a better... Ah, uh, that'll work. I've, I've started setting up the card camera, but it's not quite set up yet. So, Brock, you can come by and pick those up. Yes. Brady, Brady was definitely the big winner. It's, that's a risk. I mean, that's, you guys are taking risks. I'm taking risks. You know what, I, I just, what, that's three, two, two, three, four, two, three. That was a $300 hit. That was a $300 hit here at Grand Slam, but I got a happy, happy, happy customer, and that's what I care about most. 
I know I know Brady's probably going to give. I don't know. I know he's not a Cowboys fan, but still, that hit was incredible. It was awesome. And the cool thing about it is, is like, I'm not trying to like boost numbers or anything like that, but having someone win on the first try with one entry for 10 bucks, it'll make it more likely to where people do it more, you know, people will be more willing to buy into something like that because they'll see that it's a possibility to win. But everyone, I'm signing out. Gage Graham up here in Columbia Falls, Montana. Stay safe. Wash your hands. Make sure you have food. And I'll see you Friday. Let's shoot for Friday. I'll put that. I'll put break 16 up as a pre-filler. And uh, don't forget Mini Mania. Mini Mania is a good way to get in on some breaks for cheap. I'm doing uh, five spots for $14 where top spot gets two. Second spot gets one. And then four spots for $6 where top spot gets one. So you can get one of these main spots for six bucks or you can get a couple of them for 14. So thank you everybody. Have a good night. Congrats to all of our winners. I will post a winner's thread here probably tomorrow and uh, yeah, see you later.